Hi, I'm Henry. I'm Ian. And we are Bosch. Welcome to Baby Bosch. Today it's Christmas, so Ian is going to be cooking eggnog. A vegan eggnog. Now, eggnog is very much a Christmassy delight for a lot of people. Let's crack on. What, what do we want first? We're going to lace the underside of the pan with maple syrup. So there's three tablespoons of maple syrup in there. This is going to be a tasty dish. It doesn't necessarily have to be insanely healthy. Well, eggnog, it's really, really creamy. It's really, really thick. It's really, really luscious. And it's a treat. It's the sort of thing that you would not have all the time. We've actually had loads of people asking us yeah. for eggnog recipes. If that was you, then here it is. What we're going to do now is take our brown cane sugar. Hit brown yep, sugar in there. Right. There's another three tablespoons. Stir that into the maple syrup. So in here now, we're going to put the vanilla bean paste. If you don't have vanilla bean paste, you can use vanilla extract. Yeah. Smell that. Oh wow, yeah, I've got that vanilla. See that? Look at how much that looks like a brain. So apparently nutmeg and walnut is good for your brain. And it looks like the brain. Exactly. That's um, a good old grate of nutmeg. Next up, this looks like a cinnamon stick. That's correct. We'll roll that around. And now what we're going to do is put the naughty stuff in. This is soy cream. How good that looks. And you could obviously use any plant-based cream. I'm just going to fire it up a little bit more. Now what we're going to do is get that to a gentle simmer. You've got these little bubbles appearing around the edge of the pan here, which means it's up to speed. And now we're going to pop our 500 milliliters of soy milk. And you can use any plant-based milk you so wish. So we've got brandy here. How much brandy are we um, gonna put in? There's 150 mils. I mean, this, oh, it smells so Christmassy. Yeah, that's it. Got cinnamon in there. We've got a little bit of sweetness coming from the maple syrup and the brown sugar. Um, I'm down with this. It, so that's now done, what's next? It's time to taste, I feel. We've got our lovely little mug here. Ideally, you'd put this in the fridge and you'd have it cold, but we can't wait. Warm eggnog seems like a thing that your grandparents would have. I'm getting the cinnamon, I'm getting the two layers of sugar. There's the nutmeg, which we added extra nutmeg. Cheers. Really tasty. Yeah, it's got a kick, but not too much. Mm. Slightly alcoholic, slightly punchy, but incredibly warming. Mm. So there you have it. That is our baby Bosch. This is Bosch's quick eggnog. Perfect for Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.